All right, so you have a story for me, yeah. Mr. Kirstein? Yes, yes. In the textiles. In the textiles. With, uh, when I was with Hard Pro Textiles, we were selling canvas. So I covered the whole area, the whole Chabanel area. Yeah. And Ron Latz needed canvas. Pashabelle. Pashabelle, yes. And he was at 555 Chabanel. If my memory serves me right, still on the third floor. And I go up and the order's a roll of canvas and I bring the or well, I had a lot of orders and I bring all the orders back. And Jack, who was the owner, says, what do we do? I said, we'll ship him, it's only a roll, let's take a shot. Why was he, why would he say that? Why? Because his credit wasn't that good. Okay. And, uh, and then he paid us, and we start. I, I gave him more canvas. He ordered two rolls and then five rolls because he was a big user in those days. Right. Anyways, then I did in 1984, I did the launder cheating. And uh, I went to Claude Hubbard Dyers. And I didn't know, and he didn't know what to do, so he called his man down. So he said, you remember Dominion Textiles? We did it, and then they closed the machines. They did, oh, yes, yes, yes. So he says, send me in uh, a thousand meters, and I'll give you four colors. So I send him in four thousand meters for that laundered shading and I gave him the four shades clothed at upper dyers and it took about uh, two weeks and it didn't come out so good the crinkle but it was 60 or 70 percent crinkle anyways I he ships me a, a four thousand meters back and I cut my samples and who do I go up to see first? Pasha Bell, Ronnie Latt, because he was doing a big job with sportswear. And I show him, I said, Ronnie, I didn't go to anybody. You're the first one. You better grab it. It's a new thing. I have it done right here in Montreal, I told him. So I show him the four shades, and he says, you know what? said bring me up five meters of each i said i'm not charging you if you're gonna throw it under the cutting room table i'm not doing anything he says harvey i promise that i'm gonna make up samples because i'm the first one you didn't give it to anybody i'd be a fool not to make it up i said you're damn right i run back and I cut this uh, five meters of each color and I run back and I give it to him. It took me no more than a half an hour back and forth. Right. Anyways, and I got 4,000 meters, a thousand meters of each color. It doesn't take a week. He, the phone rings. Yes. Harvey, Ron, yeah. How are you? I said, you got good news? What have you got on the floor? I said, a thousand meters of each. Ship it in. <laughs> Just like that. Wow. I say, Jack says, what do we do? I said, let's go. He pays. He paid for the canvas. He must have 75% sold. And we're going to get paid. We'll take a shot. Because if this thing checks out, he is going to need thousands upon thousands of meters. He says, if you say so, we'll take the shot. We ship him in the 4,000 meters. Right. And the rest is all history. I so, used to give Claude Lemaire Lord. So he took a, a lot after that. Oh, I couldn't give it, not only him, everybody found out about it. Right. All the sportswear, all the dress manufacturers, all the shirt manufacturers. Men's even found that I couldn't get enough of it. I couldn't get it out fast enough. Wow. Sam, a uh, junior C, he was the only one I who I allowed to call Claude at Hubbard Dyers 
to deliver direct to him. That's how fast Sam and dresses wanted it. I, wow. The rest is history. I used to give clothes on white only. White only. A hundred thousand meters at a crack. White only. It's crazy. That's so a good that's story. So that's the story with Pasha Bell, Ronnie Lance, as you brought it up. All right. Bye, I put him on the map. Yeah. There but it is. Have the a night. rest is all history, sir. Yeah. Well, the battery's <laughs> running out, so we better cut it short. Yeah. Please. Okay. Bye. Goodbye. <laughs>